order, honourable members, honourable trainees. Thank you very much, Madam House Chair. For those learned individuals in the House today expecting an academic lecture from me, I'm sorry to disappoint you. This is a parliament, not a university convocation. The Constitution of the Republic is very clear about who qualifies to be a member of this House. The framers of the Constitution made it this way so that it didn't matter whether you were a mine worker or a brain surgeon, you could still participate in our democracy. And how ironic it has been to see the EFF, the so-called vanguard of the working class, argue now for some form of qualified franchise, where only those with university qualifications can get elected and serve in this parliament. You see, this is the ultimate hypocrisy. The EFF On like a point to of order. Oh, honourable member can take a seat. What's the point of order, honourable mentor? No, th that's very, that's misleading. Order. It's extremely misleading. Order, honourable members. It's extremely misleading. It's the DA's order. position in the KZN that people must honorable have qualifications. Member. Order. EFF did not come up with qualifications. He must deal with his Chair people person, and order, his order, 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 standing on. He must leave the order. EFF out of Chair, it. Chair, what rule? You must not extremely on? mislead honorable the country. Member. You must order, read your rules. Mentor. It says you either Chair say person, what you want to say or you go the rule. I said what point rule? of order. You must go back to school and read. Order. Honourable Member Mentor, that's your point of debate, is not a point of order in terms of the rules. And therefore, that was not a point of order. Honourable Senez, and can you proceed? You see, this is the honourable, the, the honest form of hypocrisy. Point of order, Madam Chair. No, this is harassment. Come on. Order, Honourable Matthias, what's the point of order? Can Honourable Estes and take a question? No. It's a very private and personal order. question. Order. If it's a private question, therefore it's not for can the House. Can you take a can question? Can please take a a seat, honourable member. I want to I'm humble him to today. Order, can you please take a seat? It's too pompous. Can you please take a seat, honourable member? Honourable Matthias, can you take your seat? You see, this is the ultimate form of hypocrisy. The EFF like to play dress up as miners and domestic workers, but they don't want real miners and domestic workers to be represented in this house. Like the old English upper classes who kept the working class locked out of Parliament with their Oxford degrees and their Cambridge qualifications, they don't want ordinary South Africans to be part of the decision-making process in this House. Let me be very clear. I don't have a university degree. I've never pretended that I did have one. I enrolled for a BA in uh, politics and law. And I, but due to financial and work pressures, I couldn't finish it. I'm not ashamed of this, and you can laugh all you like. I'm not ashamed of this, because I knew from an early age that I wanted to be a public representative, and that I wanted to work in politics chair. to make a, a difference in the lives order, order, of ordinary order, South Africans. Can you take us in? What's the point of order, Honourable Member? You're not ashamed to that order, you don't have a degree, but I'm ashamed to mention that you also don't have matric. Can you please take You also please. don't have matric. Mention it as well. Would she come Honourable members, I've just been speaking to the members of the NA table because, unfortunately, the system here, I can't switch off the mic because honourable members know you must stand on a point of order and mention what rule. You can't just stand and make a point of debate. Honourable Senators, you are protected. Can you proceed? I was elected as a city councillor at the age of 22. For the last 20 years, wherever I've served, I've represented the citizens of this country honestly, diligently, and with my very best efforts. I've never once used my position to line my own pockets. I've never once abused provincial tender processes to make myself and my family rich. I've never once stolen the savings from the poor and vulnerable order. to buy fancy houses order. and swimming pools. Order, Honourable Member, what, can you take your seat? What's the point of order? No, this is irrelevant. We are discussing the bill. Order, not, thank you. Not, not, not Order, honourable member, can you take your seat? 
Chair Honourable Member, is a point of debate. You can proceed, Honourable Members. Chair it's within the context of the debate. Would you please protect the Speaker? I You've am protecting the Speaker. The and the Honourable and Waters. And this is very relevant to the debate Honourable on Waters, false qualifications. I've just protected the Speaker. Can you proceed, Honourable Steinazen? It amazes me that this party of academic elitists who parade on Instagram in academic gowns is the one party that consistently resorts to thuggery and chaos in this house. If that is what a university education gets you, if that is superior logic, you can frankly keep it. But let's call out the last 48 hours for what they really are, a smokescreen. Whether it's this ridiculous attack on me or the disgustingly personal denigration of Minister Godan and his family, or the vile abuse the EFF have meted out to journalists who have exposed them, it is a smokescreen. A smokescreen to mask the corruption of their party and the network of patronage and rent-seeking that resulted from the looting of VBS Bank. The EFF knows that this is fatal to their brand because they have stolen from poor people that they claim to represent. They are desperate to refocus the public's attention on something else, and they will use Pantam anything, Pantam me Pantam or Minister Godan, to do Pantam so. Pantam Pantam the point of order. Yabong Aslan. Lana wa kulunya wa tuwa lenta yoguti eh. EFF ya malu tafita. What is the point of order? Can you please take your seat? Can you take your seat? But God dang us try Can you please take your seat? That's not the point. I was trying to be here. Order, honourable members. Point of order. What's the point of order, honourable member? The member is casting aspersions on the members and is misrepresenting facts. He Chair says person. the leaders of the Chair EFF person. are VBS looters. Leaders of the EFF are members of this parliament. He must substantiate what he says. He must bring a substantive motion in order for him to honour the order. country. You must Chair go back to school. Can you please school. take your There's seat, no honourable member? That's gonna bite honourable you Mente, there. go to school. Can you please take your seat? Order, honourable members. Can I make a ruling? Order, honourable waters. Can you please take your seat? Honourable members. Honourable members of the DA, can you please quiet down? Honourable member, in terms of the point of order that you raised that relates to. Rule 85, there hasn't been any impugning on the character of the member. The reference was referred to a party, and that is not out of order. The Honor reference Mente, was made to the leaders Honor, of the EFF. Leaders of the Honor EFF are Mente, all sitting here in this Honor parliament. Mente, the reference Honor was made Mente, to can leaders, you please take your seat? not to the party. Can you take you your seat? You must not be biased, Stop. Can you please take your seat, It Honor was made Mente. to the leaders, and the leaders of this, the EFF sit here in this parliament. They don't sit Chair in the air. Mayor, they sit please. here. They are members of this house. You ought to protect them. Uh, Chairperson, Mayor Honorable Mayor. member. Mente, can you take your seat? I've made a ruling on that matter, and if you have got objections, you can send it to the relevant processes. What's Chair, the point of order, Honourable Waters? 92, point yes. of order. Uh, Chair, it's quite obvious the EFF can dish it up, but can't take it. The fact is the EFF are VBS looters, Honourable if they like it or not. Honourable Steinazen. Honourable Steinazen. Honourable Mente. Can you please take your seat? No, we're not going to be insulted. Can you It's not please? going to happen. Honorable we're not going Mente. to be insulted by racist DA people. We're not going to be racist. Honorable Waters, can you take your seat? Honorable Mente, I've said I've ruled on the matter. And if members want to challenge the ruling, they can proceed. Can you proceed, Honorable Member, to conclude oh, your speech? Honorable oh, Member, what's the point of yes. order? We are not going to be told by a racist Can DA that we are corrupt. They must withdraw that we are corrupt because we have not been proven by any court. They remain Honorable racist member. of note. They are not. Honorable In fact, they are the one speaker that received money from Guptas and they even sent back a tenth note. Honorable These racist member. and corrupt people, they come here because they use their white privilege. They think that they themselves Honorable are member. immune. That racist.
Honorable Member, can you please withdraw that statement where you refer to a member as racist? Point of order, Chair. Point of order. Honorable Member, can you please take your seat? Point I will rule on the matter later in the day. Honorable Stenez, can order, you proceed? Chair, I'm up. Chair. Honorable Members, can you please take your seats? I will look at your statement precisely because there was a lot of noise and will then come back and make a ruling to the house honorable stenies uh, and can you chair, please chair, chair. what is your point of here order? i am what's your point of order honorable member? not only are they VBS honorable looters, member. They honorable are elitists, Mandam. they are Mandam, you are just a moron in the pa you, you are in a racist organization you are racist, racist organization and Fandam is one of those morons that you can honorable fool. members you'll never not deceive not us you VBS looters? Honorable You are in a racist organization. Who are racist? You remain in a racist organization. Insignificant in TA. You remain insignificant in TA because you are a moron. Honorable members. Honorable members. Honorable Fandam. Honourable members, honourable chairperson. Honourable members, honourable members of the EFF, can you please take your seat? I have said I will come back to this house with a ruling. Can you please not degenerate the house and be in order? All of you, as well as Honorable Van Dam, I said she must take a seat. Honorable Shengwa. Am I audible? Oh, yes. Yes. Honorable Chair, I rise in terms of Rule 92.1. I request you, Chair, to exercise your powers and kick people out. We will not be subjected to a tit for tat of the DA and the EFF in this house. We are not here for their politics. So I Thank you, Honourable Member. To please assist us so we can do the business of the House. But we can't just now be Omar Kut and Walumsa Ganoso and Zegala. Thank you very much, Honourable Slango. I have Honourable Honourable Member Kahuna. Take your seat. Can you take your seat, Honorable Makaul? Can you take your seat? I have ruled on this matter and I don't want a debate. Anyone who has a problem, you can actually. The hidden hypocrisy and their leaders' lavish lifestyles. We are not afraid of this little band of wannabe revolutionaries with their academic posturing who think that by quoting Karl Marx, Franz Fanon and Chairman Mao makes them friends of the working class. You don't need a degree to see the EFF for what it is, an elitist clique that steals from the poor and the downtrodden, and we will continue to call them out without hypocrisy and without fear and without favour. Thank you. Order, Honourable Members. Honourable Killian. Order, Honourable Members. Can you please take your seats? There is a member on the podium.